So I'm in need of a place board to teach Rosie to be steady. So I'm going to show you how I'm going to make it. You need some 3 by 2 studs and a piece of board. Here I'm using the top of an old wardrobe which measures 78 by 47 centimetres. Right, let's get to it. Just need to sharpen my old pencil first. Now I'm marking one of the studs to length. It's time to do all of our cuts to get all four pieces to length. The ends fit nice and flush in between the length ways pieces. Now where did I put that pencil? What a surprise, it's behind my ear. Now I'm marking for some pilot holes so that I can get the screws nice and central to the studs. I'm using 4x50mm, um, standard ones from Screwfix. Then drill pilot holes in the board. Countersink. If you haven't got a countersink tool or you can't find it like me, you can use a 10mm drill bit but be careful. Right, fix the two side studs. Wedge the end bits in and if you've done it right it should be nice and tight like this. Time to get the old persuader out to make sure it fits properly. And then feel to make sure everything's nice and flush. That's lovely. Right, there it is. Now for the AstroTurf. You need a piece like this and a knife to cut it. I got this one from Sainsbury's, it was about seven quid. So I'm cutting it from the back with a piece of wood underneath so I don't dull my knife on the st uh, slabs underneath. That should be enough. It's quite easy to cut with a sharp knife. Action. And then I'm just stapling the, the piece into position. I'm not bothering to stretch it because the mat's just big enough to get two of these out of. And here it is, the finished product. Here's Rosie testing it. Have a go at making them, they're not expensive to do and it's quite a fun job as well.